नमस्कार डेंड्रफ इज सच अ वर्ड विच मैनी नो इट वेरी वेल दे सफर फ्रॉम डेंड्रफ एंड लेट मी टेल यू मोर देन फिफ्टी परसेंट पॉपुलेशन अडल्ट पॉपुलेशन ऑल ओवर द वर्ल्ड सफर्स फ्रॉम डेंड्रफ दिस इज सच अ डिजीज इट इज अ सिकनेस इट इज अ सिकनेस ऑफ काल इट इज सच अ थिंग दैट द फ्लेक्स दे फॉल on you flakes on your forehead and you feel very terrible when you are with people around people want to avoid wearing dark clothes because on dark clothes dandruff flakes are seen very clearly so see the whole psychology which is behind dandruff person doesn't like dandruff person doesn't want to be mixing with other people they want to avoid because that dandruff is bothering well let me tell you for every problem there is always a solution and solution is there in yoga but we have to understand first the causes of dandruff dandruff is nothing else but fungus infection the fungus is called as malasazaya this is the condition of skull and here this fungus its character is very clear fungus feeds on the oil the sebum sebaceous glands are secreting oil all over and on the scalp also oil is there so this fungus feeds on oil and this whole combination forms little flakes and these flakes then are seen outside so the point is that we should understand that it is an infection it is fungus and that fungus has to be removed and we should know how to deal with it it is not a big problem but it is a problem which needs definitely attention because if attention is not given then do you know what happens of course hair fall and along with it comes all the other problems like even pimples on face like acne even pus cells are formed even boils are formed and person is not at all comfortable with all those things in the head so we will have to deal with it very seriously and we'll have to see that we we'll remove this definitely dandruff from its root and so we will tell you how to go about because of this dandruff person really feels scratchy and itchy all the time it's not a good feeling no so now since i have told you about the cause let's understand the other causes and so here comes first is oily skin basically oily scalp and that is one of a very big cause second when you feel oily you want to wash your hair very regularly very frequently that's how i watch people and which is so wrong that rather causes more damage to your hair third tension and stress in any case fourth weather changes and all that and fifth sweating profuse sweating i have seen people they sweat from head downwards so badly that actually the sweat is as if flowing from the head down all these things could be taken care of with the help of practicing yoga proper circulation proper hygiene proper management maintenance the hygiene of scalp is poor and that's why what happens is infection redness pus pimples acne and really a uh, uneasy scratchy feeling all the time certain practices when we start doing it is a sure sure treatment and the quickest treatment for this dandruff problem so here are certain asanas first we should do because a good circulation on head region means good health good oxygen and relaxation would work wonders to handle any disease and so this fungus infection so i would give you three asanas which we should be doing regularly so the first asana i would strongly recommend is chakrasana where you are bending back you are bending forward you are staying that in forward bend position for some time where circulation goes very nicely to your face head region second asan would be adho mukh shwanasan 
that also is an asana where the forward bending is there and you are doing something very easily to handle your problem. Third asana is Sarvangasana. It in any case is a head low posture and it helps scalp, head, neck, shoulder and it works wonders in bringing back to natural glowing health. Well, so now let us take help from all those natural things which are there around us to help us remove the dandruff nicely. First is five to six hibiscus flowers. See that you take these hibiscus flowers and boil them with little water and then blend them to make a paste out of that. Then use oil, coconut oil and with that make a paste. Oil should be warm so that it mixes very well. Now this paste we should apply on the skull. Nicely rub it, apply it on the skull and then leave it for one to one and a half hour over there and then wash it with warm water. This hibiscus flour, coconut oil, this combination works wonders because it is rich in content of amino acid and vitamin C. This combination really helps to strengthen the roots of our hair. Another thing which would help tremendously is fenugreek, that is methi seeds. So take some methi seeds and have a yogurt. See to it that you put two, three leaves of curry and two, three little amlas, complete amlas. All these things should be mixed and mixed it so well, blended it very well. And now this mixture we are supposed to apply on our head. It really, really feeling comes that it goes so smoothly on your skull. Keep it staying for some time and then wash it well with warm water. Now this is a very good combination because higher rich in vitamin C again. It really would help strengthening roots. It would help removing the fungus and make your skin lubricated well because curd yogurt is a very good moisturizer. A third mask would be a combination of lemon juice, yogurt and honey. All these three ingredients are so useful. Mix them and apply them on your head and keep it for some time and wash it out. Now this is observed that first of all lemon it just removes the dandruff very easily. Now the yogurt curd will be rich in lactic acid, lactobacillus enzyme it has and second is lemon which is citric acid and honey a beautiful moisturizer. This combination really helps removing dandruff. Well there are certain things which you should do to help yourself further. One is that people usually feel that dandruff means dry scale, so they apply oil. Now oil always spreads infection, let me tell you. When there is an infection, you should not put oil. But if you want to put oil because of some other reason that you feel very relaxed and you feel very fresh, then you can put oil, but remove that oil within one hour. Don't keep it for a longer time in your head. Second, Try and see that you pull your hair. That hair pulling is a very good exercise. It really helps uh, circulation till the root. Third, take a thick comb and do the back combing. That back combing is a very good exercise for the hair. And so try and do that. And see that you can use your finger also very often and move your fingers on your head to see that the flakes don't stick to your scalp. And this is how when you help yourself, it would really help you and your health. Well, so understand, problem has a solution. I have given the solution. So there is nothing which should irritate you or affect you. Because if mind is negative, weak, then nothing really works. So try and enthusiastically use all these things, do all these things and you will be free from this dandruff. It's much, much easier with the help of yoga. Well, so you will be surprised that how a key to so many problems lies around us in nature, in our culture. So take care.
नमस्कार